actually it's a used scrounged up step makes it nice to come into the motor home so you picked yourself up a nice used late 70s GMC motor home and it's in the Rona collapse era that's where we're at today what is it April 22nd April 22nd and we're right in the middle of the Rona collapse it is sad what do you do what's the first thing you do when you buy your motor home in this situation in this environment you go out and buy yourself some Clorox clean up bleach and you do it quickly because it is it is very important to turn it on number one you need to kill the Rona all right if you have some old socks laying around clean them get that stuff moving around okay get the bugs off of here get that Rona kill that Rona yes let's do it again let's hit it twice we'll use the new rag on the stainless look at that kill the Rona on all the handles first thing you do is kill the Rona make sure you go on all the handles see all the handles like this boom boom spray a little bit on there right spray get the Rona there's a good chance there ain't no Rona here there's a good chance there ain't no Rona here all along here we're going to get every one of these handles but where you sleep where you sleep this has to be done look at that not only do you get the dust off but you get the rona right here where your head might be right there where your head might bounce up and down when you're sleeping the handle get the Rona off of there get the dust off of there get the dust off of there and get get it out of there well, later on we'll take a bucket of water bucket of water a little bit of bleach clean all that out this is going to be quick very quick video tell you get those germs off of there see right in the corner there get those germs off there. that's a lot of germs huh that's a lot look at that that's a lot of germs years years and years a buildup you got to get the, some of that glue some of that's just old blue. See that? What do you think? You can even hit the walls if you want. You can even hit the walls. You gotta go around and hit them all. Good luck. Like I said, you gotta hit everything because that Rona is sticky. Remember the Rona virus is not alive. It's just a gooey, sticky gunk. People don't realize Look, the Rona virus is not alive. It's just some sort of gooey, gunky thing that sticks and will kick your ass if you don't have an immunity. Some people have a built up immunity to the cold viruses. Right here, you see these? See these right here? These handles? You gotta get those front and back. Alright, that's about it. You wanna hit you definitely want to hit your table where you're going to eat. If any eating surfaces like this, 
and the eating surfaces. Hit them twice. Hit that sucker twice. Once this towel's this, this towel's a little dirty. See that's a little dirty. Hit it again with a clean, a cleaner one. Let's see how it turns out this time. Still a little dirty, huh? Do we have to hit it three times? Do we really have to hit it three times? Let's take a look. Okay, yeah, hit that baby three times if you have to. There's no shame. There's no shame in hitting it three times. Three times a lady. Three times a lady. Hit that sucker. All right, that's all I got for you today. How to survive in your 1978 GMC motorhome during the Rona collapse. The Rona collapse.